to a new studio vlog. It is Monday the 25th of April at about 11 o'clock and I haven't spoken to you yet. I went away for a few days camping. Um, I'll insert some footage here. long weekend camping um, so I have been cracking on with orders um, Etsy orders as soon as I got in I didn't have any orders on my website um, while I was away but I did have did have um, I did have a few on Etsy so cracking on with them Ella's off school today so she's been helping me this morning and um, they're nearly all done I'm just printing the last um, I've got two more cards to print and then I'm just making some yellow versions of the plum bulb, plum bulb stickers because someone messaged me and asked if they could have the green, the orange, the red and they asked if I could do a yellow so I'm just just making those as well and then we're all done. I need to sort some social media content because I hadn't got anything pre-done so I didn't post anything whilst I was away. I posted the stories but I haven't posted anything um, on my grid or anything so I'm not really surprised that I didn't get any orders because I wasn't I wasn't selling I wasn't like reminding people of me <laughs> uh, and my products so um, I've got my wrapping paper to open I have resisted temptation it arrived Wednesday, Wednesday? it arrived Wednesday just as I was leaving so I brought it up here and walked away quickly <laughs> um, so I could not get distracted and open that so I've got that to open. My backing cards for my gold digger pens have arrived and they are cute. How cute are they? And then the pin will fit in there. They're not far off being done. Um, I asked my manufacturer for an update. Had pictures of them, the gold digger pin and the four Kickstarter pins and they're just, the enamel's done. They need plating and they need the screen printing. Um, and the glitter needs adding uh, to the Niffler the gold digger one. I don't think I got glitter on the other ones, which is very unlike me. <laughs> All my pins have normally got glitter on. Yeah, that's where we're at. I've got um, a local Comic Con on Bank Holiday Monday, which is a week today. Um, so I'm making, uh, going to be working this week on getting more Comic Con appropriate stuff printed and ready for that so I'm going to do lots of the 8-bit collection stickers make sure I've got plenty of those. I'd like to do more comic cons but I uh, thought to ease myself in with a local one it's Buxton Comic Con that I am I've got a stall at I'm hoping it goes really well um yeah 
but I'm getting into the swing of markets. I do really like doing in-person markets. It's seeing people's reaction to your products in real life is, um, yeah, it's really cool. Um, oh, I don't know if I told you. I haven't, I'm not up to date with editing, so I don't know what I've told you last week and what I haven't. But I bought a spinning card display stand, you know, like the ones in shops. Um, and I've got some peach spray, spray paint, do you think? Peach spray paint arriving today. So if that arrives early enough, um, we can spray that today. slightly different this time and um, I normally go for the uncoated I've gone for the silk there's a mark on that one as well I need to check my files and then message the company because I'm not happy with these they're not as good as previously let me check some of the bottom of this pile. What's it there? That's not, that's not my file. That's just a mark. Pretty sure that that's not me. I think that's something at their end. Because it's not the same. I'll check the file to see if that smudge is there. But that, that drag down is definitely not. See, it's not the same on every one, so some it's worse than others. So that makes me think that's the problem at their end. Because it's not... If it was a, a print, um, an error on the pattern, it should be the same on each one. Right, let me check then. Oh! Um, I've spoken to the company with the wrapping paper and they are going to reprint that for me. Yeah, so I'm I'm happy with it. I thought I thought they would to be honest because I've I've been really happy with the customer service and the quality before, so I thought it was just a hiccup rather than yeah, a major issue. Um yeah, so that should be coming in the next couple of days. Um which is good because I wanted to take it to the market uh, books and comic con at the weekend. Um, I fell out slightly with my cricket. <laughs> um, I've recalibrated now. I'm about to press cut on it again now to see if it will behave itself <laughs> and actually cut properly. Yeah, not much to report today. It's just with having a few days worth of orders on Etsy to catch up with, it's just taking that much longer. Yeah, to just go through them, I've normally just got a couple after the weekend, and I think I had ten. So, um, and I've got caught up with some emails and um, I've ordered the freebie sticker for the Kickstarter so that should be arriving in the next um, week or so um, so it should arrive at the same time as the pins because the washi tape is should be being shipped um, this week as well I think um, yeah so I'm hoping what time are we on we're on two o'clock I need to leave in about an hour so um, I'm hoping in that time that I can get these stickers done. All my, I've ordered the blah, 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 blah. I can't speak today. Um, I've done all the labels for my orders anyway, so I can get all them on. Um, and then it's just these last couple of stickers that need to go in one. And then I'm hoping to get some stickers, single stickers done ready for Comic Con. Um, yeah, to get ahead of the game on that. And then I can work on sticker sheets tomorrow. Um, some of the Mario power-ups um, I might do a couple of Pokemon mugs as well to take with me I don't think I've got any more coasters so I can't do any more coasters but I did do some last week so yeah I'm just trying to focus more game Marvel that kind of thing for Comic-Con um, I do want to 
do some more cards so I've got more selection I need to print out some some more variety of cards because I can't fit many in my current card holder display thing <laughs> so yeah I'll print a wider selection the spray paint I delivered has been delivered but I ordered it to home so I can't do that today I've got an hour left to crack on with things <laughs> now Tuesday. I have just been getting on with getting some stickers cut that would not print <laughs> yesterday. Um, I've to topped up the axolotl ones. I need to put them on the backing card. I put a lot of highlighter on my nose. <laughs> like Rudolph but just shiny. Yeah I've also printed and cut some um, of the Mario, Luigi, Toad and Yoshi um, stickers. It printed like this yesterday. Like, really dark. Look how dark Yoshi is. Let me show you the comparison. So that's how it printed yesterday. And then that's the actual colour that it should print. I mean, look at the difference. God knows why. I don't know what was happening. But then after that printed, I tried to print the axolotl ones to see if it was my print settings or something um, that was the issue. But they wouldn't print. It wouldn't print anything, so... I've restocked on my um, packing boxes, the C6 size um, pit boxes, ready for the Kickstarter. And I'm going to go through this week maybe, or maybe next week, and make sure that everything that is ordered alongside a pre-order. Um, so there's a couple of people that have ordered other pins from my shop to make sure they're separate so they don't I don't want to accidentally sell them twice especially with going to markets it's it'd be easier to accidentally sell one because I I think I might have sold my last um lost princess tower uh yes yes uh this morning um along with a pre-order for the um, Enchanted Castle ones, so I want to make sure that I've put them separate. Um, yeah, so I might do that today, so it's done before the market. Um, my spray paint is here, so I'm going to do that in a minute, because um, it's about time to let the dogs out. So I'll do that while I'm outside with the dogs. I'm going to, I'm going to quickly pack, pack this order, um, and then I'll go and let the dogs out and spray the cardstock. So I'm just a little bit short. <laughs> I didn't quite have enough in that one tin. It was hard to tell because obviously the meter coverage um, is for like a solid object and because the card rack has loads of gaps in it I didn't know how much I would need and I'm a little bit short and it's out of stock. Um, I've just messaged the company that sells it 
to ask when it will be back in stock so hopefully it will be back soon it's not too bad um i could probably get away with it when it's full of cards you probably wouldn't really notice but i know <laughs> so it needs sorting um but yeah it, it dries quickly though it's just the the base for it but i thought i was worried about it being heavy but it's not heavy at all um it's just a bit awkward um yeah it'll have to go across the back seat i don't think it'll fit in the boot of my car um it'll have to go across the back seat but yeah happy with my little facebook marketplace fine and it looks more peachy mimi ish <laughs> oh look it's not that bad it's just the odd bit can you see let's switch the light on it's the odd bit that's not Yeah, there's an odd bit that's just, it just needs one more. It looks a completely different colour than the lights on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it looks a completely different colour than now, but I might spray the top of this as well. I avoided that. I've accidentally got some on the bottom bit. And I think it needs, I think it's going to knock the paint off around here should we see if a card actually fits in there <laughs> grab some of these please fit oh yeah the tour though so Yeah, I'd, I would, wondered if I'd fit prints in, but I don't think I will. But I think I've got a couple of each. In there. Let me try. Oh, they look fine. They're not too... Yeah, so I can fit a good few of each. There's three there. Spinning away from me. Oh, you can fit more. Looks alright. There's an odd nick on it. It did say that it was as new. It was used, but as new. But I think that was stretching the truth a little bit. Because it is a bit nicked in places. But, yeah. Another coat of paint. Like that, look. But... It's cuter than it was. <laughs> I fit loads in there. Gosh, I need to print some more cards. <laughs> How many spaces are there? I might I might do some I could do A5 prints, they definitely fit, but an A4 print bit. Let's see. Let's get one out of the box. I don't think it will. I think it'll be no, they're too wide. Um but I could fit A5 prints in there. Maybe. Yeah, because I didn't have many cards on display at markets because you can't see them in that other card rack. So now I can have loads. How many spaces are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that's 48 spaces. Gosh, that's a lot of cards. Um, I best get printing some cards for this. I best get printing some cards. Um, people of the internet, 
also so nice. I know, I know not everybody in the internet can be nice, but people in my little bubble on the internet, particularly Instagram, are so lovely. Um, as you know, I have my goal of 100 orders a month and I posted a couple of days ago on Instagram that I, how close I was, I can't remember exactly, it was like 20, late 20s and I've been tracking it throughout the week and I think I've now only got nine, I need to double check, but I think I'm only nine orders away from hitting the goal now. Um, and we're creeping up with the pre-order as well. Um, I've had a couple of more pre-orders. I think people were waiting for payday for that, but yeah, everybody's like, just so nice. <laughs> um, yeah, so if you're watching this and you are in my little, and you follow me on Instagram, um, I just want to let you know how appreciated you are. Um, and I'm very thankful for you lovely group of people. Um, so yeah, I've got some orders to pack up today. Um, the gold digger notepads are now out of stock. So I need to check money-wise where we are at and see if I can order some more of those. Because um, if I can order some more, then I can take some of the ones... Um, from the pre-orders to the market with me because then they'll arrive before the pre-orders need to go out anyway so I need to crack on I have so much to do today um, I need to make sure I've got enough cards for all them stands it's my mum's birthday tomorrow so I need to get all her cards printed um, yeah I've got a lot to do why? why does this always happen when you've got loads to do? The printer did not want to play ball it was printing all stripey I did a couple of head cleans and it was still printing stripey so I've had to do a power clean which takes about 10 minutes to do so that's done and it fingers crossed whispering it seems to be working okay but I have got so much to print today so I really didn't need that it is now 20 to 11 20 to 11 and I haven't printed a single thing yet but someone's ordered the snacks sticker sheet so I have just uh, <coughs> made the amendments to that to make it on the new backing so <coughs> I did that while I was waiting but it's it's still <coughs> Um, yeah so let's hope the rest of the day goes a bit better because <laughs> I've got so much to do and I could do without <coughs> equipment playing. I've got to use my coffee yet hello um, it's Sunday it's the day before the Buxton Comic Con and I ran out of time on Friday so I've got stuff to do. Yeah, so I've just got some of the Gold Digger stickers printing. I've got loads of cards I need to print still because I've still got two sides of my Willy Gig. It's not called Willy Gig. Um, to do. So I've got a list of things that I need to get done. Um, I just ran out of time and I don't, I'm not sure what time the setup is yet. I'm still waiting to hear so... Um, I don't want to come in and say I think I'm going to come in early in the morning and then have to leave early anyway because it starts at 10 um, in Buxton which is about half an hour away from where I am so um, set up's probably 9 maybe a bit earlier um, yeah and I don't know where I'm going so I'll want to leave plenty of time so I'm not going to want to come here at like 6 tomorrow to get everything done and then I'm proper against the clock Whereas if it takes me longer than the hour I've allocated today, it takes me longer and it's not the end of the world. Can I do this one handed?
the poor little boat, Uncle. It's out. 